guys. In this video, we're going to talk about Boeing. We're currently trading at 221.52 here on the daily chart. And you can see that we had a red, we printed a red candle in here today. We are still up 65 cents on the day from yesterday's close. We thought yesterday, all right, indecision doji, um, gap up this morning. All right, hey, you know, it might be looking green. Spoo's, everything's green. Dow went up 210. And then Boeing just ended up with a red day. So we're still up 65 cents, but a red day printed. Um, so going forward, what are we looking at? Well, this nine day EMA is going to be our first immediate resistance that's currently trading at 222.32. Above that, it will be this 224.58 level. Um, you can see we went up and we touched that today, just could not breach that. So that's going to be a major resistance for us. We get back in there, it's going to be choppy in between here and the 241s. Um, so it's going to be a slow grind once we get above these 224s, I believe. Um, but you never know. We'll have to wait and see what happens. Um, below that nine day EMA support, it is going to be this um, 200 day moving average here, currently trading at 222.33. And then below that, you're going to be looking down here right around this 217 area. RSI in here, 38, Stochastics 46. So we're in relatively oversold territory. So we might get a nice little push in here. Thought it might be coming today, obviously with that indecision yesterday and then a gap up this morning. But um, Boeing had other plans apparently. Um, IV in here is relatively low. IV rank at eight. You have a raw IV of right around 42%, $8 expected move by next week. And that is your earnings expiration cycle. We have earnings coming up July 28th pre-market. So we thought, hey, we're going to run into earnings. Why not start early? I guess Boeing had other plans. So look for a run up into earnings um, especially if we breach over that 224 range. I'm not going to run up to 240 anytime soon, but we might run up just a little bit um, heading into that earnings expiry or the earnings um, on July 28th. Your August monthly is pricing in right around a $15 expected move. And that's currently your, your RIV is right around 37%. So um, a little bit of juice in here, but not a whole lot. Um, basically all your IV is sucked into next week's expiration cycle. So be on the lookout for that when you're trading this, just kind of keep that in mind. Watch this 220, the mid 224s, 224, 60, 224, um, And then keep an eye on this 200 day moving averages. That's going to give you a nice little, um, kind of projection of your resistances and supports and here going forward playing this into earnings okay guys thanks for watching make sure to check us out on our social media we have attached the links to our socials in the description and we also have a trading service if you are interested there's more information in the description below